Bout number nine, just about to start now. Referee giving the final instructions to these two young warriors in the red corner, representing Minotaur's gym. We have Matt Vladar. This is his fourth fight. He's had three fights, three wins so far, undefeated in the K1 world. His opponent, Catalin Philemon, representing the South End Academy, fighting out the blue corner, wearing the black trunks, and we are on the way. Exchanges with uh, low kick. Nice kick to midsection. Very swiftly returned by Philemon. Lagarde doing a good job working the hands and throwing that kick into the, uh, the thigh. I'd like to see more of the fighters on the show actually block these kicks. Quite a low punch there, not too low blow, but it was getting close. Strong exchanges from both of these guys here. Really powerful kicks being thrown left and right, both sides of the body from both of these guys. Vidar just coming off the ropes there. Philemon just heavily guarded behind that ball. Those gloves nice and high. Just peek out of them, waiting for the blow stop. And then he strikes straight back. There you go. Wastes no time at all. As soon as he thinks it's the last blow thrown by his opponent. He opens up, counter fighting him off. Nice and comfortable, pushing forward. <laughs> Stiff looking job there from Vidar. Uh, Straight into the guard though of Philemon. Nice tight guard there from Philemon. Nice combination there from Vidar, the strong shots. A high kick. And low kick from Philemon. Left and right there, both landed. No attempts to block these kicks. Oh, not sure was that a low blow or a body shot. I don't know whether that just took the wind out of him there. I wasn't sure that was quite as strong as that. Philemon complaining that it was a groin shot. So, uh, time to recover is perfectly fair. And Philemon coming back with a vengeance, not happy about that. Oh, looking composed here, looking calm. Strong left turning kick there from Philemon. And right to the midsection of Dar. Flurry of punches. And Dar on return. Yeah, nothing that the bar was just everything was just a little bit, just an inch too far, inch too far, inch too far, just not quite hitting the mark as Philemon was moving backwards there. But Both of these two guys exchanging really solid shots, and that's the end of the round there. Superb start from both of these guys. These two warriors coming out to the centre of the ring, touching gloves, get the action underway for the second round. And these guys starting off at a superb pace. Everything they're throwing, everything looks dangerous. Solid shots there from Bazaar. Philemon looks like he's starting to tire a little bit more. Vladar still looks super fresh. Everything is thrown is sharp and powerful. Not wasting, not wasting much here at all. Strong right knee to the midsection there from Vladar. That one was definitely above the belt. And left hook there from Philemon. Philemon trying to pressure Vidal back. He just, just as he gets him in the corner, just to get him in the spot where he could tee off, he then eases off. I was going to about to say a nice turning kick there from uh, Vidal and the midsection. Very swiftly replied back from Philemon. Uh, Chris Blake Ross. 
Nice left hook there, after a little combination from Vidar. That's it by a left turning kick there, finding the mark to the midsection. Oh, oh a no, couple of nice shots landed by either, both of these guys here, both dangerously close to the head. Left, strong left there from uh, Philemon. Philemon coming just a, a tiny, slowing down just a tiny bit here. A bit more singular in his shots. Looks like the effects of the fight are starting to take hold. Adar, on the other hand, has been a bit more conservative with what he throws, but when he throws it, it all looks dangerous. Left hook to the body there, and again from Philemon, covering up that crab-like defence. Oops, a little slip there from Philemon, just a slip. Ooh. Knee there, getting dangerously close to the face. And that's the end of an explosive second round. of sportsmanship here from these two young fighters as we get the third round underway here of this three round K1 bout. Again fighting out the red corner representing Minotaur Jim. In the purple shorts we have Matt Vladar and his opponent in the black trunks fighting out the blue corner representing South End Academy we have Catalin Philemon. Nice strong knee to the midsection there from uh, Vladar and a high kick there. Hasn't seemed to wobble Philemon too much. Philemon replying with a high kick of his own. Oh, and a stiff looking left there from Vladar. Nice to see him sort of capitalize on this. He sort of takes his foot off the gas there somewhat, giving Philemon an opportunity just to recompose himself. Again, setting that high kick up nicely, even with the defense of the glove there. You're not going to want to be on the receiving end of too many of those shots. The baseball bat coming around and hitting you in the forearm. And Vladar now just seems to be picking the power shots here. Philemon really looking exhausted at this stage. And he has every right to. He's been literally fighting two for now from the second the bell's gone up until this point. And in the closing moments of this fight. Solid looking turning kick there to the mix section. You can see the damage appearing on Vladar's body, but Vladar replying with one of his own. Huge big punch there from Vladar. Not doing too much to trouble Philemon. Philemon looking exhausted. Looking exhausted, just slightly more tired of the two fighters. I don't know if Vladar's got enough in him to really push the pace here. If he can push the pace, this could be really decisive for him here. He too is also looking fatigued. And both of these guys have every right to be. They've put on a fantastic show tonight. They have literally thrown everything at each other. Ooh. Yeah, these guys have pulled no punches. Everything they've thrown at each other has been with power, has been with menace, has been with bad intentions. Maybe I'm not sure what happened there. I think Philemon's complaining of another low blow. I'm not sure that uh, I saw a low blow there myself.
These guys, in the closing seconds of the bout, they've had a little moment to recover and recompose themselves there. Whilst Philemon was recovering from uh, another alleged low blow. Again, I'd need to see the uh, the replay there to sort of have a closer look at that. I missed it. Oh, dangerous looking cross there, landed from Ladar. And the bell perhaps couldn't have done quick enough there. Both of these guys put a phenomenal show. Ladies and gentlemen. 